Trees, you lot. Trees. Morning, boys. Books. How nice. Games. Erica on embroidery. Hidden talents. <coughs> Shouldn't we be taking the boys' names, Mrs McCluskey? Oh, come now, Mr Griffiths, there's an amnesty. Where's your spirit of fair play? Well, it just seems odd letting everybody off. Nonsense, they've done the decent thing and returned their overdue books. One day you'll go. Cathy knew with a certainty from deep within that one day she would find Chris gone. Didn't know you went in for romances, Gardener. Ah. I had to put these books in the art room. And boys, I want each of you to write me a pricey of the top book on your pile. What's a pricey? Nice to see you in charge again, Mrs McCluskey. Oh, that wasn't a punishment, Mr Griffiths. That's part of their education. what we've done. We might as well run it off. Yeah, if I said we should get on with it. Uh, maybe I ought to have a look at it before you run it off. Oh, I think there's something to say in this. Danny, could one person enter more than one designer? He usually scarfers early for a fair. Oh, I don't see why not. But don't forget, you've got to think of a title for the new magazine as well. Mm, maybe he's going to do us a front cover. Imagine. <laughs> Here you are, Chris. New magazine. Thanks. Can't you get a look at it? It's a school magazine. I suppose you've read it from cover to cover? Yeah, but I know what's in it. There are different ways of keeping fit, that's all. Oh, yeah, I know. Sprawling about in shiny leotards. Not for me, Liz. Hello. Rangers on to the Fleet Street. What have we here? You lot seen this? Ah, the new Puritans. Cracking down on smoking, aren't they? I'll say they are. It is intended that the anti-smoking campaign should extend into the staff room. As not only can we never see anything through the smog when we go in there, but it is a bad example to us all. Signed, the committee. Hey, I see that. Sure. Who is responsible for letting this through? Don't stir up trouble, Morris. It's perfectly harmless. If it is harmless, you have nothing to worry about. In the meantime, I suggest you delay circulating these, these pamphlets or whatever they are. Come on. Anyway, it's too late to stop them now. Some of them are already out. I don't know what you're worried about, Morris. You don't even smoke. That is beside the point. We cannot have pupils telling staff what to do. It is the thin end of the wedge. Has Mrs McCluskey seen this? You don't mind, huh? I try to give up, but under these conditions, well... So it's you who stinks this place out all the time? And those two. This is insupportable! If you are telling me not to smoke, then you're playing straight into the hands of the kids. Oh, but Chris, a little bird tells me you held a drama session earlier in the week on smoking. Ah, <laughs> oh, don't give up too easily. I'm sure the little beasts will want to get some money out of you first. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure this is a good idea? You always have to take these away out, don't you? And you always sound like your mother. Do I? Jonathan! Jonathan, that's mine! Come back here! I'll tell Dad. Oh, it's you. I thought something must be wrong. Yeah, that's right. My dad's back in hospital. Oh, we're sorry, Louise. Yeah. We are sorry, really. And is your mum still away? Who looks after you? I stopped with the kids while she was up at the hospital with Dad. Did your mum send you a what, Laura? No, we just thought there might be something we could do to help. Well, you can't. No one can. <coughs> Time for a smoke? Get out of there. I'm delivering these. First edition of the magazine? No, thanks. All about smoking. There's going to be sponsored competitions to help people give up. No chance. Oh, there's always the competition for the logo. Weren't you asking Miss Booth about that? Yeah. Here, hold this. Let's have a look. You have the temerity to stand there in full view, smoking. You might at least try to hide the filthy habit. Yeah. 
you think Carl Griffiths will want one? Do we want to see him? Yeah, like the added smoking bit. Less best for his ladies to clear up. Paper! <laughs> Go away! I'm busy! It's out of bounds! What did he say? Come in, I think. Oh, Vegas! Um, <coughs> you thought you'd like to read this, sir? Big smoky in here, ain't it? Oh, I don't know, off it! Good card you got there, sir. <laughs> Shave it's on fire, right? <laughs> uh, no, because you made me do! <laughs> 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 Then you'll be glad to know it won't happen again, sir. Hmm? We're not allowed to smoke no more. Smoke-free zone. And that includes you, sir. Ooh. 